Hey everybody, I'm back with you today for day 18 of the 31 day challenge with Marion. Um, in front of you, you probably see this big old mess here. Um, it's because I had these cursed chipboards for a while now and they were sitting in my pile with this paper that I did a swap with last year with one of the girls. Um, and it's just been sitting there. So finally, I did start it for the first, you know, first few pages. Like, here it is. So this was part of the swap, and this is all that came in it. And it says, girls just want to have fun. This was a part of this, and I just cut it. So it's really shiny. I didn't have to do too much. Um, this wasn't in the kit, and I added that on there. Then I have these, um, just pretty simple, these blings and stuff I glued on there. Because I think I'm going to give this as a gift. I may add a photo mat right here. But let's go ahead and finish this. Um, and I did ink it with my Studio G ink that I got at Michael's a while ago. It's the purple one. So I have that. That's the first page. This one is another part of that sticker set from the front. Um, so I just added it here. This one's the necklace, the shoes, the makeup, the iPod. And here is those um, clearance. This is one of the clearance um, magnet that you, you get at Michael's. Um, it was like a penny. So I went ahead and glued that on there and I just this was a tag and I cut it off the tag and glued it on the little file folder and added a bling and it just tucks right underneath um, I may have to re-glue this down though I think I just messed it up hang on a second I did mess it up oh well I shall fix it. And I fixed it with my Scotch Quick Dry Adhesive. So why that? I'm going to add pressure to that and then I'm just going to ink around the edges. Because you can't see it with the purple. So I'm going to be doing the edges with black and this purple color. And it's hard to do the insides like right here. See? But I'm going to just, you know, I'm going to cover that up with some. I have this boa that was part of the kit and stuff. So go ahead and just add a little of the black ink to make it smoky. Kind of actually like that look. So finish letting that dry. So the next part I had done was this. I glued this on here and just haven't completed it. So let's go ahead and complete it. And I've got all the flowers and stuff in front of me. So let's work on it. And I'm just using my exacto knife that I got at Walmart. <clears throat> I, I bought extra blades for it, but I haven't had to change it yet. So it's good for now doing its job like it's supposed to and it's still sharp and I just I have my calendar down at the bottom of this um, board here this is just a piece of cardboard that I had from last year from last year's calendar <clears throat> so I'm just reusing it since I'm still working on my craft table over there trying to get it ready I'm just going to trim this as quick as I can. Just to show you what I'm going to complete today. I'm trying to figure out a program to... Um, one of the girls mentioned a program to me and I'm looking into that. So I, so I can try it out. Um, but eventually I will find a program that... I can, you know, edit my videos instead of doing parts. So, 
see how it tore a little bit because I was rushing, of course. And let's see, where did I put it? Aha! Got one. You can buy these nail files at my um, the dollar store. It comes like in a two pack, I think. But I'm just gonna go ahead and file it down, file it down. Try to get some of it down there and out of the way. So now I'm gonna go ahead and get the next part on this side down. <clears throat> I try to get all the papers down first before I embellish on both sides. That way I don't have to struggle with it being lopsided or something. But sometimes I forget and I start embellishing anyway. So let's get there. So let's see, I have that purple. I'll do this one. And it's like perfect cut for this almost. Um, it may cut off a little bit on the sides, but that's okay. Try to get it on here as best as I can. And normally I cut it instead of using my exacto knife. just cut around it normally because sometimes my exacto knife drives me nuts <laughs> so this is um the uh, 18th challenge goal that I've been wanting to complete and it's the purse book um, initially I was just going to do like a square chipboard book um, the ones from Michaels because this was from Michaels last year and um, I just you know, it's just been sitting there and sitting there, and the kit was sitting there. Because when I did the swap, there was, she gave me enough for two papers, and I used the first one on my daughter's um, crown album, um, and it was all the pinks and blacks. So this one's like the leftovers, and it's the purples, blacks, and whites um, from the from the swap that we did, and um, I still have a bunch just stuff left over that I still need to use so I'm thinking about just I'm um, adding it to it like this like the boas the pink the purples I want this book to actually mainly be purple um, so I'm gonna try my best to get just do this all purple and then I think I'm gonna give this to my friend's daughter or even give it for her birthday or just give it to her um, because next week's my birthday and um, she's going to watch the kids while me and my husband go out. Well, it's not just my birthday. It's my birthday anniversary. Um, seven year marriage and I'll be 28. Woohoo! <laughs> year goes by and I know Susie just had a birthday. I, I haven't watched any videos lately because I've been trying to get stuff done. But I saw on Gentile, um, she posted a comment on there about Susie's birthday. So, happy birthday, Susie. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Susie. Happy birthday to you. Even if it's late. Happy birthday, girl. She's so funny and I, she's just such a good person. And we did a flower swap last year and it, that was fun. I love doing flower swaps. And right now the I just joined some swaps. I was going to join one at the beginning of the month, but I was so busy with my mom being here and then these videos starting um and then you know uh the kids school and I just I just wanted to be there and and help out at the school and I know they need it really bad. They need the help. Um, so today, I didn't have to help today because they have, I mean, I'm going to help later. But for the kindergarten, they got someone to be in there for the week. So they didn't need me. So I was like, that's okay. So I'll just volunteer in the office or the library. 
put my hours in today and help out. Okay. I want that purple to show on there, so I'm going to use that on the bottom. Can you see that? See how it like barely, just barely like fits on the bottoms and the sides. It's kind of hard to to get it to go all the way. And I think, I mean, I try not to do such long videos, but I think I could do more than 15 minutes. I think they said something about that. But anyway, I'm going to come back and show you the finished product. So thanks for watching. Stay for part two. Bye.